In today's video, you will see something unbelievable from China when it comes to building super mega projects. So if you are here to watch unbelievable super engineering and amazing construction of supersized mega infrastructure projects from China, you definitely come to the right place. So without further ado, let's get started. Hi, good day to everyone. This is Arthur and welcome back again to our channel. And now before we get started, be sure to subscribe and click the notification bell so that you don't miss any of our great contents. And without wasting any more of your time, here we go with my number one. Number one, East China builds sports venue at lightweight speed. The training base has opened for its first competition. Its main building stretches over 40,000 square meters and is 23 meters high. The construction team followed over 20 new techniques to build the base. The venue includes various advanced facilities, such as a super large indoor extreme sports venue and a giant indoor surf pool. It can not only be used to host various kinds of large-scale professional events, but the public can also try extreme sports too. It usually takes at least two years to build similar venues, but this venue was completed in just over eight months. Number two is China's first self-built semi-submersible oil storage platform. The world's first 100,000-ton semi-submersible oil storage platform, independently developed and built by China, was delivered and departed from East China's Shandong province to South China's Hainan province. Shanghai One is a deep water operation platform for oil and gas processing, condensate oil storage as well as oil and gas transportation. The platform is 120 meters high, equivalent to the height of a 40-story building with a displacement exceeding 100,000 tons, the same as that of three medium-sized aircraft carriers. It will serve the Lingshui 17-2. China's first deep water self-operated gas field in South China Sea. Number 3 is parts of Cross Sea Bridge connect in South China. The 9.36 km long Taoshan Cross Sea Bridge completed the connection of its two parts in Zhangjiang City, South China's Guangdong Province, two months ahead of schedule, paving the way for the bridge to open to traffic at an early date. The 9.36 km long Taoshan Cross Sea Bridge, a key transportation engineering project in Guangdong Province, spans the Zhangjiang Bay and connects the Taoshan Island and Haidu New Area in Zhangjiang City. The main bridge is a double tower and double plane cable stayed bridge with a length of 591 meters, a width of 37.5 meters, six lanes in both directions and a design speed of 80 km per hour. Number 4 is world's largest well foundation at Changtai Yangtze Bridge in Jiangsu. The world's largest well foundation for the main pier of the Changtai Yangtze River Bridge was precisely sunk in place in East China's Jiangsu province. Well foundations are the type of deep foundation generally provided below the water level to support bridges. 
A huge box or well with its large cross-sectional area and rigidity can stabilize the bridge against wind and stream. The number 6 well foundation of the Changtai Yangtze River Bridge will support the largest span cable stayed bridge and steel bridge in the world. Number 5 is 16,000 ton steel box girder bridge joined in East China. The final parts of the largest steel box girder bridge in China's project to divert water from the Yangtze River to the Huaihe River were joined in Hefei City in East China's Anhui Province. A canal in the project would have passed through a national highway had the bridge not been built. Number 6 is Beijing Chengde High Speed Rail Starts Operation. China started trialing the high speed railway connecting Beijing and Hebei Province, Chengde City, a popular summer resort about 230 kilometers north of the Chinese capital. A new model of the electric multiple unit Fuxing train has a speed of 350 kph and can operate at temperatures as low as minus 40 degrees Celsius. Number 7 is Winter Olympics project runs through in North China. Part of Tai Chi Chang Xilin Hot Railway, a supporting project of the 2022 Beijing Winter Olympics, was joined up, which is expected to provide support for traffic to the competition area of Jiangjiakou City in North China's Hebei Province during the Winter Olympics. The number two and number three section of the Chongli Tunnel were successfully completed marking the completion of the section linking Taiji Chong Station and Chongli District. The construction of Taiji Cheng Chongli section was completed four months ahead of the original schedule. And that's all there is to it for today. Once again, this is Arthur. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day.